Hello, I'm Ron. Welcome to Popsicle. You're probably wondering what this channel is all about. So since this is the first episode, allow me to talk about it and to introduce myself in the process also. I'm Ron Cruz. I'm an assistant professor in Ateneo de Manila University teaching biology. I teach such subjects as ecology, zoology, bioethics, uh, comparative anatomy, and several other courses including biology of science fiction which allows me to combine my interests in the biological sciences in which I am professionally trained and in pop culture, particularly science fiction. That's really what my channel is all about. Me being able to bring together science, pop culture, and everything else that is an intersection between those two. Sometimes I will even talk about miscellaneous things that I just find interesting. Those who know me would know that I'm interested in so many different things and that includes RPGs, anime, TV shows, movies in particular. And yes, the, my, my, one of my biggest passions is really cinema and so you can expect that I'll be talking a lot about it uh, in this channel. I'm also a published author of a book entitled The Cosmic Wild Biology of Science Fiction which happens to be the textbook of the course that I teach in Ateneo which is the biology of science fiction. It's available as an interdisciplinary elective and a free elective to anyone who would like to take it from any program in the Ateneo. So to the Ateneans who are watching this video right now, you can take that as an interdisciplinary elective starting in the first semester. I really enjoy talking about how to bridge the gap between my interests, which are science and popular culture. And I've had the opportunity to talk about it in several venues and every time I do it, I feel really good about it because it's my way of contributing to science communication and its value and being able to tell everyone how interesting science really is. It doesn't have to be overly technical or overly complicated. And if you find a way to link it to your interests, it's going to be much more palatable, digestible, and relatable. And that's what I seek to do in this particular channel. That's why I'm very, very excited to share with you my ideas about these things uh, that interest me. So to tell you more about what to expect from this channel in the future, I'd like to tell you about some of the ideas that I have that I will be presenting. Sometimes I will be talking about biology of science fiction. In this set of topics, I will be discussing how science fiction tropes show biology as a novum or what is new and how these biological principles are often interpreted in the science fiction texts. I'll probably start with an overview of that idea of how bi biology can be found in science fiction and then move on to more specific topics afterward. One other topic that I'd like to discuss in this channel is body horror which is one of my fascinations. In fact, I have a journal article out in the Journal of Popular Film and Television that talks about body horror as a way of interpreting or showing biological horror. I'm providing a link to the article down below so you can check it yourself. And so, in the episodes where I'll be talking about body horror, I'll be covering such things as the undead, as aberrations, hybrids, abominations, mutants, etc. There's a lot to uncover when talking about body horror. There are some episodes where I will be just giving lists of the things that I like, and uh, this may cover movies, anime, music, uh, such a wide array of topics that I'm interested in at any given moment. Hopefully, I'll be able to enlist, get it, enlist, uh, the help of some of my friends who are equally interested in these topics. There are times when I will be talking about world building, which is another fascination of mine. I'll be talking about how to build fantasy and science fiction worlds, but with particular emphasis on science fiction, because these are more grounded in science. And I'll be talking about how to build worlds from scratch, from a scientific perspective, but particularly from the biological perspective. For example, what types of organisms would you expect on a planet that's revolving around a red star? versus one that is revolving around a blue star, for instance. Some of my episodes will also talk about Dungeons & Dragons, or D&D, which I've been playing since the 90s, both as a player and as a dungeon master. And I'd like to think that because of the length of time that I've been doing this, 
Uh, there are things that I can help you with in terms of, for example, character building and uh, for the DMs out there, how to build worlds, how to create ecologies. Given my biology background, I'm going to focus more on how to handle monsters in particular ecological settings and how to build that ecological setting to be a very exciting uh, game setting for you. Also, given my fascination with movies, I will be devoting a lot of time probably to cinema, uh, not, not just science fiction cinema, or not just those that touch on science, but film in general. And uh, for those of you who have been following my blog, uh, Film Otaku, for quite some time, you know that I also do Oscar predictions every year. So I decided to do that here on this vlog also. So from time to time, you will see me updating my Oscar predictions, which are still available on filmotaku.blogspot.com, which you will uh, see as a link also below. So that's what my channel is all about. I called it Popsicle because I want to evoke ideas of pop culture and science in a nice, cool, fun, colorful, vibrant package, just like a normal Popsicle that you would enjoy on a hot day. What you see behind me right now will be my usual background and you see that it shows you the things that I'm interested in. For example, here you have the head of a Cyberman from Doctor Who. Here you have a bust of Cthulhu, uh, which my friend painted. Here you have horror books, this whole shelf, okay, or that part of the shelf, including a lower one here. You have books by Junji Ito, you have a lot by H.P. Lovecraft, who happens to be one of my favorite authors. My Harry Potter books are here. Uh, I should be putting them in a, in a better place, of course, uh, given how much I love them. You also have Game of Thrones books here and books about the Oscars and about D&D and about film. I have a whole section down here uh, try to show you here. Yes, you can see 1001 movies you must see before you die, 501 movie stars, horror movies, etc, etc. And here we have my, our uh, science fiction section. Uh, outside this room, I have another shelf with all of my fantasy books because I started off being a fan of fantasy novels before I moved to science fiction and horror. The logo that I used for this channel was made by Mateo Brand Studios and the music that you just heard in the stinger was produced by Josh Balane Music Productions. If you like what you just saw and heard and if you look forward to watching the videos that I will be presenting on this channel, Please don't forget to subscribe and I hope to see you all soon. Bye-bye!